SideQuest has just announced a major update to their platform. Right now, you can actually sideload any app directly from your web browser, from their website. No more downloading a client on your computer, trying to see if there is, you know, compatibility with your PC. You simply go to the sidequestvr.com and you can sideload straight from there to your headset as long as they're connected with the cable and as long as you have your developer mode enabled. And the best part is that it even includes the built-in VR VR game port installer so that you don't need to move the files manually if you want to sideload the team beef VR game ports. All of that is now handled automatically and it has never really been easier to sideload before. And you can even sideload using your Android phone so you don't actually need to have a PC to get it done. I will show you how to sideload just a regular app and also how to sideload one of the VR game ports. So when you go to the website and you find the app that you like, you'll click on sideload now and the first step, I like before you will need to enable the developer mode right here it is going to walk you through the process of uh, creating an organization or enabling the developer mode and even the article from meta they will explain to you why this step is legit essentially what organization is it's your developer account you don't need to be a developer in order to have a developer account it's free to register you just go to this website once you've gone here created your organization this will be your developer account it will ask you to verify your identity but it is the meta website it is not harmful the step to verify the identity of their developers to avoid bots from registering and after you've created your developer account you will open your meta horizon app you'll go to your devices select your headset right there and that's when you'll be able to see the new menu that will pop up right here saying that you now can enable the developer mode so simply go ahead and enable that and basically that's all that you need now you can sideload something onto your headset next you're going to need to plug in your headset to your PC or to your Android phone. For that, you will simply use a USB-C cable and it's going to show you this pop-up window where you will see your headset. In my case, it's Quest 3. I'm going to click on it and then click on connect. But you need to make sure that you have a data cable and not just a charging cable. And I promise you 90% of all the issues that people experience in this step, you know, their headset not being recognized, is because of the faulty cable. So before you start seeking help if something doesn't work for you here either replace your cable with a different one or try a different usb port on your computer if none of those things worked and you're 100 percent sure that this is the data cable that's working only after that you may want to ask some questions um, with their support to see if they can help you at this step you're going to need to put on your headset and you will see a pop-up window right in front of you where you're going to need to allow usb debugging you can simply click on allow or you can click on always allow from this computer in case you don't want to see that pop up every time you connect your headset to your PC and try to sideload something. And now you will see that it started installing. The spinning thing is so cool. And that's it. Basically, as soon as that's done, all you need to do to find it is go to the unknown sources in your library and that's when you will find all your side-loaded stuff. And because you've already allowed the USB debugging, if you try to install any other app right now, click on the app and it's going to get side-loaded onto your headset right away. You can use this method to side-load the SideQuest VR app onto your headset. That way you don't even need your PC or your phone at all. All you need to do is just open that app on your headset. You can side-load stuff directly from there at any moment. Quick note, SideQuest is a place where you can find all VR games for Quest, official meta games included. So if it is a meta store game, instead of the sideload button, you will see this get it on meta quest button, which will redirect you to their website where you'll be able to install the game as usual. But if you're hunting specifically for those experimental early access sideload only games, those are often featured on their homepage. So definitely check there first or go to the apps and games, click on advanced filters and under where would you like to download it from, choose SideQuest and do not select Meta Store. You can also sort them in different ways and you'll be browsing only SideQuest exclusive stuff. Knock yourself out. And now let me show you how to install the VR game port using the same method. There's just one extra step required. Basically, whenever you want to install a VR game port of a popular game like Doom 3, Return to Castle Wolfenstein, Questcraft, Tomb Raider, there's so many more by Team Beef and other talented teams you need to remember that these are just the VR mechanics that you're getting from SideQuest for free. But you can't get that game for free because those games exist, they are real, you 
know they are licensed and you need to pay for them otherwise that would be piracy so before you start doing this you need to make sure that you own that game on your computer it is installed in my case it's going to be in my steam library and then you're going to be able to use the files from that game and the files from sidequest in order to vr that game so first you go to the retro or uh, VR uh, game port section of their library and you can browse any VR port that you want to install. Simply click on that and just like before you will click on sideload and start the sideloading process. At this step it is going to install the base files to your uh, VR game port but it doesn't have the actual game files yet. However if that uh, app listing has a demo of the game it is going to be included in your unknown sources. Uh, but otherwise if you want a full game you'll Need to select the game folder on your PC where you know the root folder with all the files from that game are stored then you just click on this button and it's going to upload the necessary files to SideQuest and from SideQuest onto your headset it is simply moving them that way they are not storing those files anywhere they simply get moved onto your headset and after that you can put on your headset and go to unknown sources and play that VR game port that you've installed and it works with pretty much every VR port that you can find on SideQuest just like that you don't need to do manually uh, any file transfer it's all done for you so those are the exciting updates about SideQuest and how much easier it is now to sideload there's so many cool uh, unknown uh, games that you can't find anywhere else on SideQuest so definitely go in explore and happy sideloading